Well, any parent who's had to leave their newborn baby behind in the NICU knows how tough it can be. No new mom or dad wants to leave their baby, but technology is allowing parents in this situation to still keep an eye on their newborns 24 seven. Tonight, I'm showing you how this works. Sweet baby Landon was born last week. Oh, no, there we go. His mom Tiffany was able to check out of Cape Coral Hospital shortly after, but Landon wasn't quite strong enough. Needs yeah. to gain a little bit of strength here. So he's spending some extra time in the NICU. It's kind of your worst nightmare to know you have to leave the hospital and leave your baby here. Tiffany and Adam know staff at the hospital are taking great care of their baby, but with another boy at home, they can't always physically be here. Thanks to the Nick view, they can always keep an eye on little Landon. We could check on him anytime, day or night. This camera hanging over Landon's crib is a webcam. All Tiffany and Adam have to do is pull out their phones to see their precious boy. But you look so cute. Cape Coral Hospital's Director of Women and Neonatal Services says each baby has one. We type in the information into a computer and that um, allows the mother to have a, a uh, password that she can log into and then she can start seeing the baby. In the middle of the night sometimes we wake up and we can see him and it's just really nice to know that he's still here and still doing well. Especially during family moments. When we have like family dinners and stuff we turn on the camera and it's like he's there with us and we talk to him and our his brother talks to him and says hi to him and it's yeah. just nice. Even nicer, the technology is free to every parent. Tiffany and Adam say their hearts break a little each time they leave Landon behind, but with the Nick view, it makes us feel like we're all together even when we're actually not. So nice to see something for these parents who are obviously going through this difficult time. Now volunteers bought this technology for the Cape Coral Hospital and they've had it since November. They say it took about a year to get it up and running. Travis says Lee Health is also looking into installing these cameras at Golisano Children's Hospital. She says other family members can use these webcams to look at the cute little babies too, just as long as they have permission from mom and dad.